Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back. Thanks for joining me for another video. If you're new here, my name is Hanya and today I am going to be talking all about my teeth because I got them done. I had a procedure called cosmetic bonding with BioClear Matrix and it has really changed the way I see myself and really helped me. So I wanted to make a video about this so anybody who's out there who felt who feels similarly about their teeth can maybe look into getting this procedure done because it is cheaper than veneers and it really has increased my confidence and just generally helped me as a person really and it's something I wanted to do for a very long time. So I'm going to talk you through my teeth, what happened to them, the process of all the things that have really in general just happened to them, ha uh, the dentist that I went to, the procedure that I actually went under and then what I think about them now which is obviously that I love them <laughs> so this is to help anyone out there who's in a very similar situation to me who doesn't have maybe the expenses for veneers at the moment but still want to do something to their teeth to help themselves so let's get straight into it so I'm gonna put up some before and after pictures of course so my teeth were absolutely fine up until about the age of 11 so me and my sister used to share a metal bunk bed um, and we're talking about like in the late 90s, early 2000s. So um, we were sharing a metal bunk bed, we were playing tag, we used to mess about and play tag at night when we should have been sleeping. And I was on the bottom bunk and my sister was on the top bunk. So this was me down here and this was her and she used to like sleep with water bottles because she used to get thirsty in the night. So she had this big giant one litre bottle of water that she slept with um, and I, when we were playing tag I stuck my head out of the bottom of the bunk bed and she was on the top and she got her water bottle and she smashed my head and my head bounced off the bottom of the metal bunk bed and this tooth here cracked in half. So I have one tooth here which obviously you can't see it's underneath the bonding which is actually half a tooth but from the impact of that trauma the rest of my teeth have been affected um, this is actually what the dentist told me I had no idea why my teeth were so discolored why they kept you know having why they kept being treated having to be treated I had no idea what was wrong with my teeth it was just something I would see the dentist about and every time they tell me this is wrong with this tooth now this tooth now and I was like oh my god so actually the dentist that I went to said to me that the impact from that actual occasion so many years ago this we're talking over 15 years ago actually impacted the rest of my teeth um so i have a tooth here which is another half tooth so this tooth eventually became um eventually became decayed and actually needed to be rooted so the gray area you see in the before pictures is because that tooth has no root in it they took it out and the tooth eventually like the the nerve eventually died and it became black and that's why it appears gray black and you can actually see in some of these teeth at the front that they became sort of black as well is because the tooth was actually dying from the impact of that trauma so long ago so that is why my teeth were the way that they were thanks to my sister um, so now um i mean i've lived with that my teeth the way that they are i had braces i had you know i've tried at home whitening i've tried um dental whitening several times actually where they actually put like whitening into the back of your teeth for a couple of weeks and then you come back i've tried gel inserts i've tried it all um they do work and they did work on my teeth but the staining would just come back because the trauma was always there um so what i did was I just left it and I just accepted my teeth for the way that they were and um, it wasn't ideal for me of course not nobody wants something that they're insecure about constantly staring back at them but because I was a student because obviously I didn't have the expenses for veneers um, I just kind of accepted it for what it was and subconsciously I realized now and my dentist and I were actually talking about it like I realized how much I actually hid those teeth at the top with my upper lip and when I'd smile, I'd smile like this. So you couldn't really see the chipped tooth and the discoloration at the top was covered. Whereas actually now I'm like, <laughs> and I can smile with my lip 
out of the way as well so subconsciously I'd learned to deal with it um, and it just became a problem for me when I started working really I mean I I was a student midwife for three years and now I'm a qualified midwife and I've been a qualified midwife for three years so I have been talking face to face with people for the last six years and as time has gone by I think I've always noticed my teeth more and it's always been in the back of my head so when I have conversations with people I'm always very conscious of my teeth and even though people might not notice or people might notice but not care to me it always bothered me and if people would look at my mouth when I was speaking I'd get very like don't look at me <laughs> my teeth are ugly I know they are type thing so um, that was the main driver for getting this and I've always 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 talked about getting something done to my teeth and I finally did it so I got it done at Smile Concepts in Solihull on Load Lane. I will leave all the information of the dentist down below, uh, the dentist practice that I went to. I got it done by a doctor, a doctor. <laughs> I got it done by a dentist who is um, Claire Burgess. She is actually fantastic. She is, I cannot rave about how professional she is how caring and compassionate she is in her practice and actually how in-depth she goes with you um with the procedure she takes she took such good care of me i cannot rave enough about her so all in all the procedure cost me about three thousand pounds um and it took several appointments so it didn't happen overnight so I think in total it was about five appointments I seen um, a couple of dentists at that practice because I had a tooth to get fixed anyway and then I talked to them about getting these six front teeth fixed and I had an initial appointment to chat about what I wanted and then on the second appointment Claire came in and just looked at the teeth to see if they were in a good enough state to have the BioClear matrix done to it and she said yes and then I booked in three appointments. The first appointment was four hours long. The second appointment was two hours long. And then the last appointment was like a 30 minute checkup. So in total, it took a couple of months to actually get done just because of how long the appointments were and also ensuring that my teeth were in a good enough state to actually undergo the procedure. So the procedure that I actually had done is called cosmetic bonding using the BioClear method. Now, I am by no means an expert in this at all, but just from what I had researched and also discussed with my dentist, this is the information that I have on it. So basically with veneers, um, you have a procedure where they shave back all your teeth and then they put a strong bond on top of it and build the teeth back up from your shaved teeth to me that was very scary and something that i didn't really want to go through so when i heard there was something that was a cheaper and be a bit safer and kept the integrity of your teeth together that sounded like something i wanted to go through so with veneers they shave your teeth all the way back with chemical bonding they there was a bit of like buffing and like sorting the teeth out particularly because mine like were in different directions like the teeth on the outer edge were growing slightly inwards so she had to sort of reshape my normal teeth my actual teeth a bit but she didn't shave them all the way back and leave little like fangs there basically so most of my teeth are actually intact behind the chemical bond then what she did was she put a little plastic like shape around my tooth filled it with the composite and then she obviously like set it in place and she did that to all six teeth the bioclear method is actually a lot cheaper than veneers these are these six teeth cost me three thousand pounds um which is roughly 500 pound per tooth i think it was actually 495 possibly per tooth with veneers these could have actually cost easily up to a thousand pound per tooth veneers are very expensive however veneers last a little bit longer than the bonding does so with the bonding you have to go back every single year um to two or three years to get them buffed and polished um and also they last up to 
10 years at a max really at a push is what i've heard and what i've read whereas veneers are a lot long lasting so every 10 years i have to get these replaced however the price is much cheaper in total which was obviously what i'm looking for and it kept and most importantly the integrity of my teeth there and it didn't affect them too much um, the actual procedure itself wasn't as painful as what I was expecting so she used quite a lot of local anesthetic in my teeth particularly the first appointment which was four hours long which did the front four teeth um, that was quite painful and that's probably the worst part about this procedure is getting the um, injections put into the, the gum line the other thing is sitting in a chair for four hours so you have to be willing to be patient and also willing to get like a bit sore gums because when she actually does the procedure she isolates the teeth off with like a rubber band type thing um so a you can still breathe and not be interrupted with like your breathing there and b it just helps with like keeping the area sterile and clean i guess so that was also an uncomfortable aspect of it was just sitting in the chair for four hours the second appointment was a lot better because it was just two hours long i found that the um my gums were quite uncomfortable for about a week later and i had to take regular paracetamol and ibuprofen for the first week a week and a half just to bring the swelling down while my gums settled into what had happened to them in terms of aftercare um just brushing teeth as normal you can eat and drink as you normally would i think you have to use a bit of logic though like for myself i now drink coffee and tea through a straw people look at me really weird with it but i just don't give a shit i'm just like i don't care i paid money for these and i'm gonna look after them um and i also drink fizzy drinks through a straw i regulate how much tea coffee and fizzy drinks i do drink just so you know it, these sorts of little things are the things that will keep my teeth looking the way that they are for the longest time possible i also avoid eating staining foods like curries um as well and anything that is chewy like um meat like any chewy meats or anything hard like ice and things like that i try and avoid eating at all costs really so all in all my overall experience was extremely positive with bioclear and the cosmetic bonding if you are going to get this done i really highly recommend the dentist that i went to they were absolutely amazing they looked after me really really well the whole procedure was explained to me from start to finish on every single day that i went in and the lady who did it claire she was fantastic she looked after me really really well and you could just tell that she was an expert in the industry she knew her shit she knew what she was doing and you know the staining that was on my teeth she was like you know it's not 100 percent guaranteed that it's going to be covered up but she did it and she covered them up and i absolutely love the way that it turned out and i think it was a hundred percent worth it and if i could go back three years and do this three years ago and do it sooner i actually would get it done i kind of regret not getting it done sooner than i did but everything happens when it's supposed to happen so in my experience it was very positive i think it is extremely worth it and i think it has just increased like my confidence to the level that it really should have been a long time ago like i am a pretty confident person now um when i didn't have my teeth done anyway but my teeth were definitely something that's always been in the back of my mind as something is like i need to sort this out <laughs> yeah i'm completely happy with them so i think if you're like me you're somebody who doesn't have the expenses to spend a thousand pounds on six teeth eight teeth whatever um look into cosmetic bonding and uh, look for a practitioner who is highly experienced in the area who's got case studies of what they've done who can talk you through the whole procedure and who makes you feel comfortable and at ease because it's not easy you know already when you're self-conscious about an area it's not easy putting that trust in somebody's hand to you know improve the area and not make it even worse than what it is already but i can wholeheartedly recommend smile concepts to anybody who is local to them and even in the uk they were telling me that they get loads of people from around the uk that come into their dental practice and have this done for them so definitely check them out i would recommend cosmetic bonding to anybody i am over the moon with it and yeah that was my journey from how i went from like 
mad teeth <laughs> with loads of staining to actual teeth that I can like now smile very freely without thinking oh my god in that picture my teeth are gonna look insane and I hate it yeah it's um, definitely improved the way I see myself and my confidence levels so I recommend it to anybody anyway guys that is the end of this video please let me know down below your thoughts what you think if you want to get chemical um, chemical bonding if you want to get cosmetic bonding done if you had it done let people know your experience down below if you're not subscribed already make sure you subscribe if you'd like to and i shall catch you guys all in the next video